What's up, guys? This is your boy, Pastor Crypto, coming in with another, you guessed it, another banger. Protect your neck. If you're new to this channel, this channel is about making money and passive income. If you like any one of those things, then give me a like on this video, subscribe to this channel, and click that notification bell. And don't forget to select all. That way you guys be the first people to catch these bangers when they drop. <laughs> hey, let's get it. The Reese Bay's tokens, you know, Olympus Dial and all its forks, all of them are down. The last 24 hours, the majority of them are down. Pretty much all of them. Um, Euphoria is the only one. I'm about to check that one out, by the way, because it's up um, 8.4% last 24 hours. So, in my opinion, there's a lot of things that's going on with that. But the major news was through uh, Olympus Dial and Snowbank. So Snowbank and Olympus Dial had some issues of uh, this past week. And I think that is contributing to the prices of all these rebates tokens and the forks of Olympus Dial being down. So let's start with the original. So Olympus Dial current price is um, around $761 at the moment. $764. Um, so what happened with this one was... Someone had taken advantage of a rule improperly set by Olympus and was able to have access to supposedly, I'm assuming, closed bond, and they got an abnormal discount amount. This person received 1697 on instead of 59 That's a big, big discrepancy. You know what I'm saying? That's a lot. Somebody hit a lick. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to get on the specifics of how they did it, but according to the team, the situation um, has been rectified where nobody else had to do this. And um, it actually, you know, the price went down, you know what I'm saying? So Olympus went down. Um, it's moving back up right now. I think the last, no, it's down 1%, 0.1% in the last hour. And 24 hours, 6.2%. Uh, so Snowbank. Now, Snowbank, something happened with Snowbank. So, Snowbank, so Olympus Dial is on Ethereum, by the way. Snowbank is on AVAX. Um, this one had a lot of hype. I mean, it was a big hype machine on Snowbank. A lot of YouTubers was talking about this, and it was just a lot of hype. You know what I'm saying? I didn't participate in this one. Hey, you can't be in everything. You know what I'm saying? After this stuff happened with Snowbank, I'm glad I didn't get in. So, Apparently, they came out with another um, product called Snow Dog. And Snow Dog was supposed to be a decentralized reserve meme coin, right? This is the website. So, this is supposed to be like, a, according to the team, this was an eight day experiment that would end with a giant buyback financed by. Every asset acquired by the treasury through the mint sales. And basically, the team decided um, that they was going to create their own AMA. At least that's what they was telling the um, investors. Hey, we're going to create our own auto maker um, AMA. It's based on Uniswap. And this is what it looked like right here. So that way... This would create a level playing field. This is what they were telling the investors. So you won't have to worry about any bots front running, right? So the holders had to had to choose between selling before the buyback at an inflated market price or competing during the buyback with other sellers. Check this out. The uh, <laughs> it's not funny. I want to. Uh, Say, I'm sorry for anybody who lost money on this. You know, it sucks, especially when it's a bull market to, you know what I'm saying, to take an L like this. But it, just use it as a learning experience. You know what I'm saying? Not all projects are created equal. So, the caper, that's what I'm calling it. The caper happened within seconds, literally seconds, about 36 seconds to be exact. So, S-Dog market price was already lower than the market before the buyback so a lot of people got screwed and they're hot 
Like, I don't blame him. You know what I'm saying? So the team responded with some, you know, um, I, I don't know what to say, man. I, I, I think is um, I'm trying to be neutral on this one because I'm not in this project and I don't know the team, and um, I'm only reporting what I've seen and uh, from other uh, YouTubers and information I've gathered gathered from just doing a little research, not a lot, just a little. So basically, the team from what I read, basically the team saying, "Hey." We laid out what was supposed to happen. Everybody should have um, been able to understand the risk involved, and they probably regret not um, explaining the risk further. But based on what the team said, I think this was the intended result. You know what I'm saying? And I think only 7% of the people actually benefited from what happened. Um it's unfortunate, but stuff like this does happen. And then when the bear market hit, you're going to see a lot of stuff like this happening. You know what I'm saying? This is just a precursor to come if, when the bear market happened. You know what I'm saying? So this with the Olympus dial, I think that's the reason why all the rebase tokens are down. You know what I'm saying? Except for uh, Euphoria. Um, it even affected the one I'm high on, which is Exodia on Phantom Blockchain. So, but Phantom is pulling back up. It's at the 4.7%. Although there is a steep discount on Exodia right now. So, Exodia, they do have a new website design. And they are having that AMA, AM, yeah, AMA with uh, FTM alerts on Discord November 27th. I think it's around 2 p.m. A lot of stuff on Phantom happens in the Discord. If you want to know what's going on on Phantom Blockchain, you got to be in the Discord with a lot of these projects. If you're not, then you ain't going to know that Phantom popping. Phantom is one of the poppingest blockchains there is. Bar none. Cheap transactions. Couple cents. Not $80, $200, $300. You know, that's ridiculous. Couple cents per transaction. That's it. Popping. All right, so... Exodia has a new web design, right? So they have it. They having um some bugs. They have to tweak, and the web design is ready. And this is the test URL. This is what it looks like. First, I'm gonna show you the old one. This is the landing page of the old one. Basic. The new landing page looks like this. Looks way better. They even have the uh, resource page right here. And it had a Phantom Bridge. You can buy Exodia right here. You can launch the site. Go to the uh, actual app. And this is what it looks like. Not bad. Now this is just a test URL. This one isn't live yet. It will be live soon. This is the actual real life app. This is the way it looks. Matter of fact, let me connect my wallet. Let me connect that right now. So this is what it looked like right now, right? So let me show you what the new version potentially, well, not potentially, will look like minor, uh, minus a few tweaks they have to fix and bug and bugs, right? So this is what it looks like. Let me connect my wallet. Let me get this out of here because it's trying to connect to Snowbank. But yeah, so they have a new update. And this is what it looks like, right? This is the app. You go to the dashboard. Have all your favorite stats that everybody like to see. Everything. And I'm really... The price is going up. So I got to hurry up and get back in. So I'm about to, because the bond discounts right now is 13.85%. You know, this, unfortunately, I'm not going, this video won't go live until tomorrow. Because I already got the video out for today. And I don't want to, you know what? 
Forget it. YouTube, YouTube hate when people do this, but I'm gonna I'm push this video out sometime today. So you guys, if you want to participate, you get this deep discount because this discount is pretty good. Like, look at it. So this is the Exodia die LP. The bond discount right now is eighteen hundred dollars. Current price is two thousand dollars. So that's a good discount. The ROI is fourteen and a half percent right now. How crazy is that? So because of the price had went down. The uh, actual APR went up. So it's at 221% APY. That's crazy. They even have the calculator that everybody loves. This one is called Obliterator. I like it. I like it. So you can put it in all your information. And this will help people out a lot to figure out what they, gonna, what they get or what they will get. So... In my opinion, I keep telling people this stuff is about the market cap. Right now, the market cap on um, Exodia is only ten million, and the price is two thousand dollars. So, in my opinion, these type of tokens, the rebase tokens, the market cap, and the runway is one of is two of the most important things. Um, the market cap has a direct correlation with XO price. So the market cap is really, really low. The circulating supply of tokens right now is 5,147 tokens. Check this out. XO stake, 87.9%. 88% is staked. Is stake. The runway is 253 days. So they can keep paying this ridiculously high APY that you see here. Which is two hundred twenty-one thousand percent for the next two hundred and fifty-three days. So let's check this out. You know what I'm saying? Let's geek out a little bit. I'm uh, put in. So I got. I started with five point two two XR, and the price at the time was twenty-two hundred. That's the price I got in it. So. The future XL price. Let's say that this thing I got in at twenty two hundred. Let's say it lost a thousand dollars in value over the next, I say ninety days, right? The next ninety days. So in ninety days, the price will be twelve hundred dollars, right? So my initial investment was eleven thousand four hundred eighty four dollars. I had rounded it up to eleven thousand point five. My estimated ROI in the next 90 days with the current runway at 253% and the rebase will be 0.7, right? So let's just see what that 0.7 is. Let's break this down. Calculator. What's going on here? Let's go up to this calculator and see, see if I can get this right. Get this math. So... This is how I figured out point seven zero five nine. Now it's three rebases a day. Get paid at every eight hours. So that's two point one percent. Right? So I'm earning two point one percent a day on my initial investment. So let's keep that in mind. Now mind you. If the price drop, this APY will go up. So I'm just going to leave it at this APY because um, that would balance things out um, in my mind as far as worst case scenarios. So my initial price was I got in at 2200 per token. And say in the future, the price will drop to 1200 So even with that $1,000 drop in 90 days, I still will have... 3.6x my initial investment. That's right. I will 3.6x my initial $11,485, $84. Estimated profit will be $30,359. Now, mind you, if the price dropped this low, this rebase rate will go up. So this figure is, I'm, I'm keeping it at this low rate if this price dropped just because of to 
have it on a conservative side. I'm not going to raise the rate. So I would have an estimated profit of $30,359 in 90 days if I do nothing else but just keep doing what I'm doing. Just keep compounding my rewards off $11,000. $484 investment. So in 90 days, I will have 34.87 XI. My total return will be $41,843. That's why this is really, really powerful. So, yes, even if this price right now, which is $2,091, happens to drop to $1,200 in the next 90 days. If I'm still, if I stick in here and stake, I still would earn thirty thousand dollars in profit. That's why I keep making videos on this because this stuff is really, really powerful. And this is in a worst case scenario that the price drop thousand dollars. Now, mind you, the rebase rate will be significantly higher if that happened, but I'm just keeping it here. So that way it would balance out in a worst case scenario, right? So let's see what happens in a best case scenario. So the best case scenario is that the price, no, nah, I mean, it's not even the best case scenario. So uh, a good scenario, let's say the price stays at, where is that now, $2,091 in the next 90 days, instead of going up in value. I actually think it's going to go up in value, but I'm just trying to show you guys um, some scenarios. So let's see what happens now. In 90 days, if the price stayed the same right now with the current rebase rate, My initial purchase price. Let's keep my initial purchase price at twenty two hundred because that's where it was at when I bought it. I would make a profit of six x my money in ninety days if the price stays where where is it for the next ninety days. Although I bought it at twenty two hundred, that's like a hundred and ten dollar loss per token. I still will earn sixty one thousand dollars in profit. I will have 34.87 XI. You see the power in this? So let's just say for the sake of saying that the price drops to $900, right? In 90 days, I still would make $19,898, right? Now, mind you, if the price dropped to nine hundred dollars, the rebase rate will be way higher than this. It will pretty much double. See what I'm saying? So in actuality, I will make more than that. But I'm just gonna leave it on a conservative rate, where it just the the rate stays the same, but the price goes against me and it drops uh, to nine hundred dollars. Still a nineteen thousand dollar profit if I stick in here for ninety days. See the power of this? That's why this is so powerful. Now let's talk about the market. You know what? I'm gonna leave that to the next video. My next video, I'm talking about the market and my mentor miners. You know what I'm saying? Because it's time to take profit on those. I haven't did it, and I'm still showing you guys. I'm still making money in those. So if you like this content, comment, subscribe. Now this is your boy, Pastor Crypto. Peace. I'm out.